switching jobs. You know, when I anchored the morning show, I had some really bad hair. I mean, I got emails about it <laughs> all the time. I still get some. You know, we don't have hairstylists do our hair before each show, even though you probably think we do. In fact, I've been trying to step it up a notch and copy a certain Great Day guest hair for months. I'm talking about wardrobe stylist and personal shopper Jan Leach. There she is. See my flat hair and see all the body she's got going on? She's always got body and style, but she doesn't have to restyle it so it looks perfect. It's like the perfect hairstyle. So I asked Jan if she would come here and show me how to get that look. Jan, this is where I get ready in the morning. I have less than 30 minutes, and these are my two products. Awesome. Well, I use seven products, okay. and you can still get this done in 30 minutes. Just make sure you prep your hair. So start with a damage control spray to help protect your hair from the heat. Root lifters are amazing to use, and also mousse is going to help hold the curl and your style throughout the day. And then, of course, finish with a hairspray. I prefer hairsprays that are a little bit lighter weight because, one, you can still restyle your hair the next day. Two, you can run your fingers through it, and it just doesn't feel like you've got a lot of hairspray in, but it still holds it. And you use a lot of clips. I do clips. So when you are styling your hair, it's easy to miss pieces when you're curling a lot of hair. So clip it in sections and curl that section at a time as you unclip it. Okay, so start with like a little root lifting spray, and then you'll want to section your hair out. You know, keep it a couple inches away from your head. And what's always great is if you keep your hand on this lever, you can loosen it up as you're going. Twirl it around, let it sit anywhere from 10 to 30 seconds. It's really important to curl underneath just as much as on top because it's closer to your neck, it gets more moisture on it. It's also usually healthier hair because you have less color mm -hmm. and less product on it. So it doesn't Harder hold the curl yeah. as well. The last section I curled to the right and this section I'm curling to the left. So you want to alternate right oh. and left so that they're not all turned the same way and they look just a little bit more beachy, more natural. You can start running your fingers through it lightly. Okay, there you go. Now don't touch it. Let it naturally fall. You can move your, switch your part from side to side throughout the day to give yourself more volume, but the most important thing is to let it just go natural from here. Okay, so maybe I should start doing my hair an hour before the show. Yeah, probably. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, so here it is. And uh, another great tip is if you have these things, these really bad roots, look at that. Mm -hmm. You're supposed to go bigger. Like, the bigger the hair, the better, and you can kind of hide them, although I just showed them to the world. But <laughs> thank goodness. <laughs> Thank goodness I have a hair appointment on Wednesday night. And uh, she also says that when you curl your hair, you never want to like touch it. Just mm -hmm. leave it alone because if you touch it again with that heat, then it all just yes. goes limp. I didn't know okay. that. So well, you, you can are. borrow my uh, mirror today. Okay. Yeah, then you can take that with you. <laughs> Thank you. And if you want more information, we put Jan's contact information on our website because she actually does clients' hair and clothes. So that was very nice of her. Yes. Thank you, Claire. <laughs> Your hair looks fine. I never thought that her hair looked flat. Who, Virginia? Virginia, I oh, never it thought it was super flat there for you. I'm <laughs> kidding. <laughs> She's got like the, some of the best hair in the world. Oh, oh, there goes. Oh, there goes. <laughs> Bam. <laughs> Bam. Claire's that back. That came from nicey nice. That over came there. from the nicest person wow. we know, by the way. Oh, but wait a minute. There is a love note written on it. <laughs> Matt, I appreciate your work. Okay. Here's yeah. a band aid. No, I got it. A little sticky note. I was thinking of you, so I threw this at you. <laughs> Sweet. You've got me up. Wait a minute, there's a little blood back there. Oh, is that? Okay. Yeah. Next <laughs> on Great Day St. Louis, we are getting sugary sweet, literally. We're going to show you how sugars and sweeteners can affect your body and health. And okay, some of you are going to run from the screen. <laughs> Stick around. This is good information we all need. It is good. That's very true. Then it's time to clear out the kid clutter. Do you have toys in just about every corner of your house? Yeah, I can kind of relate to that. <laughs> You're not alone, but that mess is not good, as it turns out, for you or for your children. You're going to find out why and what you can do about it. And our deal divas, they never stop. They're on their way to earning some free pizza. Find out how you can get in on this deal as well. You're watching Great Day St. Louis with Virginia, Carol, Matt, and Kent.